This March, COVID-19 changed our world forever. We had to shut down the UCC campus on public health grounds, giving our IT staff three days to figure out how to support 21,000 students and 5,000 staff to work remotely for the rest of the year. Today, with over 100,000 hours of lecture streamed and with 250,000 online exam settings completed, universities have managed an unprecedented level of change. This change has been achieved through the dedication, teamwork and the agility shown by our teachers, our students and our IT staff, who throughout this crisis have kept Irish universities teaching and Irish students learning. Maynooth University has always taken pride in fostering a friendly and supportive environment for our students. And that hasn't changed just because we have to work apart. Our lecturers have fast adapted to online teaching, providing numerous ways to ensure continuity of student engagement and learning, from asynchronous annotated PowerPoints to live virtual classrooms, facilitating group projects and tutorials online, in many cases while juggling their own family or caring responsibilities. We are cognizant of the different situations in which students may find themselves too, so we are providing additional materials and contingency plans to help mitigate against any potential barriers, such as lack of access to reliable Wi-Fi. We are really proud of the flexibility and dedication of our staff and students in adapting so well and quickly during this uncertain and challenging time for all of us. We spent March and early April identifying COVID-19 patients, arranging testing and follow-up, whilst advising the college on the medical implications of the difficult decisions that were being taken. We've remained on site throughout the crisis, supporting students and staff, mainly with telephone consultations, but with some face-to-face -face work, webinars and videos. Two green shoots for us were assisting the HSE by carrying out the essential occupational health assessments of 180 new medical interns, facilitating their early entry into the hospital workforce and providing the COVID-19 researchers with the blood testing and vaccinations they require to commence this critical research on campus.